Hi guys! Today you're gonna be traveling with us from India to Thailand. Thailand has changed a lot since the pandemic. And thanks to this video, I hope you will avoid our mistakes. It's a foggy day, very nice day. It's not smog out there, it's fog. And we are ready to go to Thailand. Let's see how the weather is. Check this out. There is a cream with a ghee. Ghee is the butter which they are using in India. And look how they are catching birds. Poor birdies came into the airport. This guy is, doesn't have a fear at all. What is this? I hope it's not very spicy. This is our Thai airline. Very nice airline. I love these colors. Purple and maroon. We got purple headphones and purple blanket. A very nice uh, Thai music is playing. And we are in Bangkok. It was extremely pleasant flight. Amazing airline. Yeah, Thai is great service. They have good standards. I, I used to travel a lot when I used to travel from India. Look, future is already here without a human. So now Indians don't need visa on arrival. We are now getting 30-day visa just like a lot of other nationalities. Thumbs up Thailand. It's funny, you have to find uh, your name somewhere here and then you will find your driver. Or somewhere there. So we are searching for our name. Do you see a flock of birds? Oh, we have these little fishes in the reception area. Funny story. First we went to a wrong hotel. Because name of a hotel is pretty similar. So always check address where your driver brought you. And this is our bathroom. Seafood and Thai cuisine. Oh, it should be delicious. It has very good reviews. Finally gonna eat. Cyril's dream came true. Watermelon juice. Is there a 7-Eleven nearby? This is a typical Thailand. They trying to beautify every place. Even a garbage bin. Check this beautiful view from our apartment. So it's a 300... Yeah, I got 60 GB validity, which was uh, 349 baht, 35 dirhams for the entire month. Entire so 10 dollars. 10 dollars, 60 GB. 60 GB. Vacation started with some food poisoning, so this is a very good medicine in case if you have same trouble. Yeah, and we are here going to check few condos. Bubble tea for 19 baht. Which is uh, like 1.9 dirhams, which is like what half dollar. The price is for gel polish like 10 dollars, gel polish, eyelashes mm, 20 dollars, let's say. <laughs> That's how our Valentine's Day is. Me and Cyril walking with our food poisoning. Searching for a home, we'll check this Capacabana. It's one of the new condos in uh, Jomtien. I really wish we had pre-booked the place we want to live in because when we got there we discovered that all of the prime locations near the beach are full and whatever we got there was actually not good enough. So it was either too expensive, the rooms were not as good or they were just full. 
we tried the view tale apartments near the beach i think they are pretty good they are large they are a bit old but they if the if you find a well furnished apartment it can be a great stay but it just wasn't available our second choice was copacabana and we went there it's an amazing building very pretty a lot of people living there it's quite glitzy but there were not many alternatives and they wanted a cash deposit of 45000 baht which would only be returned when you get out of there which is out of question because when we returned we're going to be out of thailand too and what were we going to do with 45000 baht in cash while we are leaving thailand so it was a great place the rooms were a bit too small for my taste honestly i like bigger spaces but if you don't mind the crampiness if you don't mind a very small room and you just enjoy the glitz outside then this might be the right place for you this is another apartment for 50,000 also is the bathroom bigger? no, pretty much the same no. Oh, bathroom you don't need big mm. okay. living uh, much room is bigger just less cramping. and like two balconies there it was one Is it, is this price final or can go? See, they have a jacuzzi on the balcony and this great view. Don't have Wi-Fi or washing machine. Yeah, so you should always check before booking. But can you bet it? Not all rooms have Wi-Fi and washing machine. Paying 50,000 baht and don't have Wi-Fi. Alright, so I just saw Copacabana and I'm not really impressed because firstly there is not much warmth in the staff I think because of too many tourists Also the room was very crampy like you know it just started and finished And the same with the bedroom started and finished And really I need some space I can't be living in this new modern concept where everything is a little box I didn't suit me at all And there are just few options Yeah and it's just too much gold gold you know it's just made to impress people for no reason it's not like a living space it's like a gold framed space i love really copacabana just i wish uh, they would have bigger uh, rooms yeah i don't i don't think and more options need to be so canty and so gold you know. going to check next uh, building riviera ocean view that's how far it is from the beach accidents happening very often in thailand so be careful we need the sales office which is over there okay so Riviera is fully booked let's check two seats maybe yeah it's supposed to be not very popular and two seat is also fully booked next one the Grand Jump Tien beach Pattaya Kondo is Jump Tien beach Kondo let's ask if they have any availability it's like not very new but who cares anymore? You can live with the view on Kapokabon. It's big, but dirty and old. 18,000 per month. Have I seen her? Yeah, she's here. Okay, bye. 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 Okay, one more condo. Let's see if there is any anything available here. Very green. Behind looks nice. I hope they have something empty. This is new condo Riviera. Unfortunately, we couldn't ask anyone about room here as it was 6 p.m. and everything was closed. The office for rent is outside and it's already closed. Yeah. That's how lucky we are. Look at this beautiful sunset.